the sacred mountain of Fimbleventer. The joint's supposed to be the link between Inferno and Paradiso. They say there is an entrance to Inferno, the gates of hell, somewhere on this mountain. No one knows where, though. Hell, no one even knows if it's true or not. The only reason this overgrown rock is worshipped like some god in the first place is that no one's ever been able to get close to the damn thing. It's like it don't want you there. Every climber ends up stranded or worse. And don't even try to fly a plane near that place or bada boo! But at least your soul doesn't have a long walk to whichever afterlife you got lined up, right? I'll wait for you in no until at the foot of the mountain. Just hurry up with whatever it is you gotta do and get back there, all right? And the hotel's going on your account. With a mini bar, too. Gotta keep myself busy while I'm waiting. Forget about it. Uh, I love those miniature drinks. I can't believe you, Enzo. I didn't know the in-flight service was exclusive to fat Italians. Man, the plane ain't free, you know. That reminds me, you owe Alex the kid for the charter. Whoa! Oh, Not such a bad place when you look at it. Oh, but you gotta have a death wish to get close to that damn place if you ask me. Wow. Gives me the heebie-jeebies. What the hell? Where did these clouds come from? Enzo, this is where I get off. Say hi to the wife and kids for me. What? What? Wait, what? You're joking, right? I can't fly this piece of shit! Oh! Oh, John, I'm on my way. Just behave yourself for a bit longer.
Santa don't get paid enough for this shit. When Ed and Edna found their daddy wasn't coming back, they made me stay all the way through dinner. Don't pretend you weren't delighted. I hear Enzo's wife makes a lovely casserole. It was damn good. I'll give you that. Anyway, tell me how my babies are doing. They're behaving quite well. They found plenty of playmates here. Figured they would. Noah Toon had some deep connections with Fimbleventer and the Gates of Hell back in its day. Wouldn't be surprised to find a few of those playmates that like it rougher than the typical bots. Anyway, you need any supplies, just make sure you keep bringing me these halos. And remember, I ain't here to get up in your business. My business is making things that do business. So don't come crying to me when you... Think you gotta do everything alone. I'm here to help. Just make sure you don't bust a cap at my ass. <laughs> No wind quick? What do I ever do to them? <sighs> Shite. I'm never gonna reach Fimble Venter at this rate. Well, at least it won't be a boring trip. See me. You're putting on quite a show, little magician. Oh, you like that, huh? Wait till you see the climax. Silly girl. You'll have to do better than that to earn a tip, my dear. Who the hell are you? I'm just an innocent little girl lost in Wonderland, suffering at the hands of the Queen's trumped up troops. Hit one, huh? Enough riddles. How can you see me? Because we're both in Purgatorio, you see. 
Pepper, got Torio. So, are we heading to Thimble Venter on a shopping trip for Mummy, little one? Maybe. And she told me never to talk to strangers. Stay out of my way, or I'll make sure you never get in it again. Ooh, scary. Off with their heads, eh? Damn it. They must have heard me. If you're looking for the kid, he went that away. I don't have time to dance too long. A friend is waiting for me. Is that all you've got? Lock off! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 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 
They're after you too, then. Have you been naughty? Keeping secrets from mummy? Nope. Nothing comes to mind, love. Sorry. But since this is your bloody mess, do you mind hurrying the fuck up and getting rid of this thing? Now, that's no way to talk to a lady. No wonder your guardian angels are trying to give you a good spanking. Whatever, love. You've already been following me, so let's make a deal. You save me, I'll show you around this joint. Heading to Fimbleventer, aren't we? That makes two of us. And it'll take two of us, won't it, love? You seem to have skipped school the day they taught basic negotiation skills. You're supposed to negotiate from a position of strength, little one. Not just be a one-trick pony. Um, about that 
that trick. See? You need my power too. Works too, I suppose. I don't have time to give a shit about who you are or why you're going to the mountain. Take me there and make it quick. You stay with me, and I promise you'll end up in one piece. Got it? Wait, stop! Before I show you the way, love, you gotta agree to a little condition. Ugh. Do we need to go over my lesson again? First, Learn to talk to a lady. We don't react very well to being insulted, little one. Well then, I don't react to being called little one. The name's Loki. And what should I call you, love? I mean, ma'am. Do I look like a ma'am to you? Bayonetta or Ceresa, take your pick. <laughs> Ceresa? You don't look like a Ceresa to me. Well then, Bayonetta it is. Let's move, little one. Hey! I just told you my name is... You'll earn your name when you become a man. Ha! Try to keep up.
try to keep up. Sovereign business about. Not a clue, love. Oi! Well, whatever. If your sovereignness is going to get in my way, our deal is over. And if we're going to have to meet any more of your friends, you'd better learn to take care of yourself. I'm quite alright on my own. Got it? Your tricks aren't going to work forever, little one. <laughs> More tricks, little magician. Maybe you've got more to offer than I expected. For the time being, though, stay here and don't get frisky. There. That is the one, is it not? <laughs> 